hi everybody welcome back to my channel so um, I'm going in with a cover pink that I made myself I just um, sometimes when I'm using gel polishes you get sick of just using clear and I had loads of like light pinks and some shimmers so I just got a little bit creative and just made up a nail bed um, colour myself which I absolutely love um, and it's easily done guys um you know you could use this as a color if you wanted um but i'm using this under a gel polish the day so as i say i've already went in and applied my tips done all of my nail bed work and um, you know i obviously removed all of the skin off the around the cuticle area etched the nail plate and i cut these tips into um like a stiletto type shape so um the I'm using some glitters today from Chameleon Glitter. Um, Claire is lovely from um, Chameleon Glitters and she kindly sends me some um, glitters. So this white one here is called Reflection and um, she does a lot of like white iridescent ones but this one has a gold flex in it um, which you'll kind of see at the end why I use this one. Now this um, burgundy mix I made myself and it's using one of Chameleon um, fine glitters which is called Diva and then I also had the same colour in a chunky mix that I don't know where I purchased from so I just added it. I like the fine glitter in with it because it fills in all of them little gaps um, and then as I say the chunky glitter just adds a little bit more dimension to the nails um, but I'm sure you could you can buy glitter nail glitters from everywhere now guys so I just let that white glitter dry a little bit and then I'm picking up a bead of CJP's crystal glass and then just dipping it into that diva colour um, and just kind of doing a little bit of an ombre with it just bringing it over that white and uh, repeat the same process on the thumb so as I say keeping your bead um, quite wet um, you know don't drain any liquid out the back and then dipping it into your raw glitter and applying it to the nail that way is so much more easier than just especially when you buy them in raw glitter forms obviously when it's already pre-mixed then you know bonus um, and then as I say I'm going in with the beautiful diva which is absolutely stunning Stunning. It is just this beautiful burgundy colour but when you put your gel top coat on it everything just really shines. It is stunning. Um, it's beautiful you know stuck to a tacky layer of gel as well. They're so versatile these glitters. Um, so I think on the is it the index finger and the ring finger that's the colour that I used just the the base colour on because um, I will be going in with one of Madame Glam's gel polishes. So I'm just trying to make that blend, you know, just look as nice as possible. Um, and now I'm just going to go in with CJP's Crystal Glass and just encapsulate all of them glitters. Um, so I'm trying to do this in a one ball method. Um, working from that cuticle area and then using the belly of my brush to bring that acrylic down the nail. Making sure that obviously I have enough acrylic on the nail you know for strength and um, your apex and you know so on and make sure that obviously you cover all of that glitter because when you come to filing you know you don't want to you know like pull any of the glitter off and spoil all of that nice work that you've already recreated um so once obviously i've done all of that um i haven't got any filing in this video but i have in my previous video so if you wanted to go and take a look at that um so once obviously I've done all of that, then I'm going to go in and do all of my filing and remove all of the dust off the nails. And then as I say, I'm going to go in with one of Madame Glam's um, colours. I received this not too long ago and it's called Merlot or Merlot. Um, I don't know if you can pronounce it Merlot. 
it's m-a-r-l-o-t i'll leave the name in the description box anyways it's this beautiful burgundy wine color and as you can see it's got gold flecks in it that's why i use the white glitter and um, so i do apply two coats of this curing in my led lamp for 30 seconds each time i do have a discount code as well for madame glam which i'll leave in the description box as well um so once obviously that is cured in the lamp then i can go in with my gel top coat which is the blue sky non tacky one and just make everything shine and oh my god i love this set of nails um quite a simple set of nails but very very elegant absolutely love them um so just taking care not to get any on the skin and making sure that i'm capping all of them edges and then i'll pop them into my led lamp and cure for 30 seconds then i will add some cuticle oil and that's it guys so i really hope that you did enjoy this quick video and um, if you did please if you would give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and i will see you in my next video bye